<laughs> Another one. Yes, I got another grill. <laughs> hey yo, this is Dash. Get ready. All right, guys. So if you've been on my channel long enough, you know, or if you are one that can't pass up a free grill, there's no type of grill better than a free grill. And this was a free grill. So I am going to go over this grill in the next video. We're not going to do it today, but I just got it home not too long ago. I'm going to get it off of the trailer. And it came with a couple extra goodies. So I don't know much about this grill, aside from the fact that I went and I looked online, there's a tag over here, it says PDQ Cooker, and it has a patent number, and it also has a peel box, and it says Johns Island, South Carolina. Don't know where that is, but doing a quick search on Google, I found out that this particular smoker or, or grill, however you want to use it, it's made by a company called Low Country Cookers. I think that's what it is. It's either Low Country Cookers or Low Country Cooking. I'll put an image out there. Anyway, you guys know what this means. Start it down below. I, I, I'm not even gonna say what, what you need to start doing down below, but go ahead on, just go ahead. Now, we're gonna do an in-depth walkthrough of this and I'm also going to try to get some more information so that I can have more information when I do an in-depth walkthrough. But I do have some plans for this thing and I'll tell you right now, I'm gonna try and replace these handles. I don't know if there are bolts on the other side. Also, I wanna put some D-rings on here because I would like to use this in traveling with in conjunction with Johnny Five, the five foot grill table. Well, I think this will be a great addition to on site cook, cooks. Now, one of the other things that I need to address right away these wheels down here are stationary, none of them turn, they are it is what it is one of the other things too this grill sits really low i am getting a little long in the tooth i appreciate things that are a little higher so i'm going to try to see about figuring a way to put this on a different type of platform put this on something else where it will be riding a lot higher and also have better wheels other than that again i mentioned d-rings uh new handles on all around this entire thing and we'll we're just going to see how it, it goes from there. So if you're excited, like I'm excited, <laughs> I know, I know. Start it down below. I, I, I'm not even going to say what, what you need to start doing down below, but go ahead on, just go ahead. Well, bottom, baby. <laughs> Thank you guys again, as always, for watching. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. If you like what you saw today, if you learned something, please leave me a comment and a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to turn that notification bell on so you can be notified whenever one of these videos goes live. Speaking of live, I go live every Wednesday night, 9 p.m. Eastern. Two hours. First hour, we talk about barbecue and or something barbecue business related. Second hour, we kind of shoot the breeze, talk amongst friends. Make sure you bring a, a, a cool refreshment with you. Anyway, thanks again as always for watching. I'll see you next time.